Noy Leib, a soldier with the Israel Defense Forces, joins us now. Noy is a businessman and startup founder who is living in New York City when Hamas attacked. He flew back to Israel to volunteer with his elite paratrooper unit. Uh, Noy, it's, it's such a pleasure to have you this morning. Thank you for your time. Thank you for having me. We have seen images of Israelis from all around the world, <laughs> yourself included, flying back home to Israel to enlist. Uh, what compelled you when you first got that news, um, you know, to give up your peaceful life in New York to go defend your homeland? I mean, you see the night that we're living in. Our people are being raped. They're being tortured. They're being killed. In one day, over 1,400 Israelis were murdered. You have 200 Israelis kidnapped in the Gaza Strip being tortured. There was no way that I was going to sit in my comfortable New York apartment while the rest of my teammates and brothers were fighting. So it wasn't a question of if, it was a question of when. And as soon as I heard the news, I looked for a flight and I got back to Israel. The selflessness is just beyond admirable. Did you leave family behind in, in New York to come fight this war? No, I don't have family in New York. All my family is in Israel. My other two siblings are also serving right now uh, on the front line. So my parents are here worried just like every other parent in Israel um, with the, the heartless savages that we are facing right now. Yeah, and who wouldn't want to just rush to family uh, and fight alongside them? Where exactly are you stationed now in Israel, if you can share that? And what can you tell us about the conditions there on what is now day 17 of war? Uh, I'm, I'm stationed in Israel, that's what I can tell you. And look, we're physically getting prepared. We're mentally getting prepared. The stories every day are getting worse and worse and worse. And we have threats, not just from the Gaza Strip, but also from the north. And people are saying Iran is in the picture. So right now, it's a very tough time for Israel. But as history has shown, Israel always prevails. And in the end, we will win this war. And Noy, you know, I'm, I'm sure the emotions ebb and flow as your unit receives new information and updates and, you know, new imagery on a day-to-day -day basis that is just hard to stomach. What's the morale like among your fellow troops there on the ground? We, we are ready to go. Um, it's not something that we want to do. It's something that we have to do. You know, people ask we, us, are, are we scared? A little bit, just enough to keep us on our feet and understand that we're dealing with a threat that is worse than ISIS. We're doing a PhD in Hamas studies. We're learning every single thing about the enemy and we're coming prepared. The morale is high and we're going to win. Yeah, an education you never wanted to receive, I'm, I'm sure. Uh, lastly, Noy, as someone who was living in America until very recently, what is something that you want us Americans to know as you fight to defend Israel? Yeah. I want you people to know that uh, supporting these, you know, innocent Palestinians doesn't mean that you're anti-Israel. You need to understand that Israel doesn't want this. There are a lot of innocent Palestinians out there, but the blame is to be put on Hamas. Hamas is forcing these innocent children. They're locking them in their in their houses when Israel is telling them to go. They're 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 destroying their lives. And what we're trying to do is create a better future for both Israelis and Palestinians. But we're working with terrorists. So you need to understand that it's not just about the poor Palestinian people. Our people are being killed too, and we are defending ourselves. Um, that, that, that's what we're doing. That's it. Yeah, yeah. Well, it's very well said, and we're we're praying for a peaceful future for you. Uh, Noile, please stay safe. Uh, our best Thank to you, you and much. also your, your family. Take care. Thank yes, you, very much. you too. Care. Thank you for watching. Go to newsnationnow.com to find News Nation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of News Nation's fact driven, unbiased coverage.